Julian Sagan, Charlie Bilodeau from Canada, as mentioned, from Montreal, and sitting fifth after the short program, six and a half points out of a podium spot. A series of fourth and fifth place finishes on the Grand Prix the last few years and looking for that first coveted podium spot in Japan. than we've seen on any of the teams thus far. The first of the side-by-side -side jumping passes. Very nice triple toe, double toe combination in excellent unison. up the side-by-side -side triple sow cows. Just spectacular. Slight touchdown with the free foot on the way out. It's certainly not a major break in the program. Triple loop, so far to the outside in the air, getting that weight over the right foot just in time for the landing.
fifth at the Grand Prix of Russia to open up their Grand Prix campaign. Trying to work their way onto a podium. Bilodeau and Sagan of Canada. And the scores from Osaka up next. And here's a look at that opening triple twist. Watch the hands right on the hip bones to a nice, easy press to that right back outside edge as she comes out of the air. So important to see that cleanliness. A lot of times we see that free arm wrapping around the waist, trying to keep control, but the clean catch is such an earmark for these elite teams. But the throws, if they want to get back to that elite status where they were so competitive early last season, these little touchdowns have to go away. They're very costly. You're giving up points on the grade of execution. And when you're already at a deficit with your components from missing so much time, you can't give away those little points. So the slight touchdown with the foot on the first throw, the slight touchdown with the hand on the second throw, those moments really go a long way when you're trying to make your way into that final flight get back on the Grand Prix podium where they've seen themselves before. They're capable of big scores, but that cleanliness is very dependent for them to get back to those big, big numbers that keep them elite. You can see that they're happy. They've gone through a lot over these past couple of years, but they have to continue to work that cleanliness so that they can book their ticket to Pyeongchang. 186 is the season's best. And 130 puts them into first place here. One ninety four thirty seven. So a new season's best for their total score. So it's a season's best in the free and the total for this pairing from Canada. They are our new leaders with the Austrians up next.